Hey guys, what's up? Hope you're all doing good. Hope you're all doing fine. We are right now at Tumkur and we are going towards Tarikere. So we have taken the Tumkur highway and we'll be taking a deviation from Sira to reach Tarikere. So we have stopped here for a small chai break and hope to see many places soon. So apologies for the timestamp which is displaying in the video. So the thing is I had formatted my SJ cam action camera and I forgot to disable the timestamp. Hence the timestamp is being displayed. So it's displayed as 2016 because that's the date when we bought the when we bought the SJ cam. So yeah, so that's the reason the timestamp is being displayed. I'll make sure that the timestamp is being removed from the upcoming videos. This definitely was a much needed break for us because we had not been anywhere outside for a trip for more than 200 kilometers from maybe past about 10 months and here we go. We, we were going on a Friday and as you can see there aren't any people itself on the road hardly one or two vehicles which are moving and few trucks were there but that is fine they'll just definitely give some way for us so that we can pass and i think the road was amazing a three lane road we were cruising around you know proper speed and i think we definitely had a good drive at that moment so after this we'll be reaching Sira maybe around one and a half hour I guess and yeah so the road is definitely good and we are having a fun time. So the roads were butter smooth and we were cruising around 100 km per hour easily so that we can reach the Sira junction at the right time and we reached the Sira junction around 1 hour 10 minutes so we were taking a deviation from the Sira junction to the left hand side towards Belgur.
The distance from Sira to Bilguru is approximately 80 kilometers. We were bored of the national highway which we had taken because they were all straight roads. And when we entered Sira, the roads were absolutely amazing. It, there was complete black tarmac roads. The roads were exquisite. There were coconut palm trees on the either sides of the road which gave a scenic view. But after we entered, maybe around half an hour, we encountered few patchy bad roads. We went on and we found there were still more bad roads. This was for about maybe uh, five to six patch roads and later the roads definitely was very good. We reached the Belguru temple at around approximately 11 am and we were invited with the marvelous 4 to 5 arcs of the Belguru temple. This is the famous Ratha of Belguru temple and this the speciality of this Ratha is it has all the poets of Karnataka inscribed we took the darshan of the Sri Veera Pratapa Anjanaya Swami temple and the two nearby temples too. So we were very lucky to enter the temple without any queue because during the weekends this temple will be jam packed. In fact the entrance of the temple the temple larks which we had seen before there will be cars which will be parked over there too because that there will be many people who will be coming to this temple and this temple is also powerful and for the people who visit this temple if they wish any good things to come in their life then definitely it will work after the temple darshana we went to get the blessings from the Bilguru Swamiji and later we had our lunch at the temple premises itself which is a very good initiative which is pro done by the temple authorities humble request for the devotees when they visit the temple just make sure that the sanctity of the temple remains clean actually the temple is really well maintained but the lake which is beside the temple is actually polluted there are different kinds of birds which visit to the lake but it's unfortunate to see the polluted water in the lake and there are many birds as i said yeah so it would be great if the lake is cleaned properly and well maintained so that even many birds can visit the lake and it can even make a good tourist spot we left Bilguru around 3 pm to Tarikere the distance from Bilguru to Tarikere is approximately around 85 kilometers and the ETA was around two and a half hours and our goal was to reach Tarikere before the sunset 
the route from Belguru to Tarikere is absolutely fantastic because we pass through country roads, we pass through villages, we found even small hills while driving and when we neared was the town of Vasudurga there were windmills which were inviting us and the view was absolutely superb so we reached Tarikere in around maybe two hours and it was a rest for us for the complete day because we were literally tired we just had traveled for around maybe 250 kilometers I feel from Bangalore to here to Tarikere and this was the first trip for us after a long time in fact it's the first trip wherein we we personally are driving the car for more than 200 kilometers and this trip was definitely worth the start was really good and the next day is going to be an amazing one so stay tuned from the for the second vlog I guess I'll be uploading it soon because definitely I'm excited to edit that vlog that's gonna be an amazing one stay tuned you'll get to know about it until then if you like the video please do hit the like button comment share with your friends and family members and if you're new to the channel please do subscribe to my channel for more content second vlog, second vlog will be coming soon have a nice day everyone cheers